My name is Sylvia Staples and I'm an alumni of Alabama a and University. I work for the USDA Forest Service and I'm a proud participant of the ESA Seeds. Uh, what's special to me about the Seeds program is because it's a way to bring so many students from various backgrounds, various cultures, um, various aspects of ecology together in one place at one time to share their experience together, everything they're learning, where they are, and ways to bring it all together for in their future of ecology. My name is Carlos Sayas. I am a graduate student at the University of Puerto Rico Maya West Campus. I am studying biological oceanography. I was a SEEDS fellow. I've been a SEEDS member since my undergraduate days. As a minority, I feel represented when it comes to the SEEDS meeting. Um, it's important for me to have peers and, and see mentors that are of Hispanic descent that can serve as mentors for me. I am very proud to be hosting a SEEDS leadership meeting in Puerto Rico. I have participated in many in Washington DC and in different places, but it's good to show what we can do and what we have to offer as an island for leaders in ecology. Um, I think SEEDS played a role. It showed me that there are more aspects to ecology than I was aware of before the SEAS meeting. It also, that was my first time to New Orleans, so it opened up my, opened up the door to uh, exploring new places um, that I've never been, um, different cultures as I mentioned. And so I'm thankful for SEAS because it inspired me to travel more and to be more involved in ecology and to uh, realize it was more than what I was being taught at my university. This leadership meeting provides the experience that students don't get in a classroom, for example, communicating science. That's our responsibility as ecologists and as field scientists to communicate this science and have practical experience in the field, engaging communities and bringing them the knowledge they need to empower themselves.